Good morning, my Capricorns. It's Friday. It's the weekend. We made it. We made it. I'm losing my voice now. You know what? I shuffled these two decks before I hit record, thinking of you guys like the creeper I am. And look at the bottom of the deck. I got two eight of wands. Isn't that funny? At the bottom of the decks. Capricorn's like, I have to make this happen. Even if I have to go buy umbrella, it's happening. Very, very cool. All right, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If you are a Capricorn, know a Capricorn, feel like being a Capricorn. Well, Capricorn, I am so glad you're here. I hope you guys have some fun plans this weekend. Hope that you're doing something relaxing. And it's one of the, is it the last weekend before summer? Last weekend of summer? I don't know. It's my birthday weekend. Maybe next weekend. No, next weekend's the last weekend of summer. Okay. I'm ready to go. I'm ready for fall. Don't you love fall, guys? Okay. Enough about enough about my desires, Capricorn. We're all about your desires. Okay. What do the Capricorns need to know? What do the Capricorns need to know? Okay. What is that card that fell out? What is that? Ooh, Hangman and Four Swords, Pisces and Gemini Energy. I'm going to put it back because I don't feel... You can note it, but the hang I feel like it's getting away, getting away to a p like to relax. Maybe you're overwhelmed at this time or gosh, I did not ask the question. Okay. What do the Capricorns need to know? What do the Capricorns need to know? Justice reverse. Well, that kind of does go with it. Something not coming together, being treated unfairly, right? That's, that's Libra energy and it's a major arcana. So it's like a, a big thing in your life. It's not in your head. It's literally happening to you. What's influencing the justice reverse and the world? Closing that shit out. Look at that. Look at that. I think you're changing one world into another. Yeah, this is all about expansion too. But you're just leaving the unfairness behind. I feel like what if this is a relationship or a job, you just, you, you got the short end of the stick. And, and you're letting it go. You're closing it out. You're in completion, right? You're coming full circle. Just ready for a new chapter. Okay, what is the reason for the reading? What's the reason for the reading? The Six of Swords, Aquarius Energy, moving on. Remember I said about the vacation? Look at that. She's going to drop an anchor on an island to get healing. Because Star can be healing. but it's And maybe you'll find your wish fulfillment there. But she's letting her, like, I always think of that. She's her intuition, her soul's guiding her to this new destination. I love that. And it's like riding the storm clouds of life. And maybe you've been in a, you feel like you've been in a storm cloud for quite some time with this justice reverse. And I do feel like it's starting to clear or it will be clearing soon in the lighter energy. It's like, it's coming your way. What's in the past, Capricorn? What's in the past? What happened in the past? The Eight of Pentacles, working on something. Transformational energy because of the butterflies. Ooh, you know what I got? Well, okay, we'll go back. Let's see if the other cards support that before I say it. What's in the outcome or outcome? What's on your mind? <laughs> All over the place, I'm sorry. What's on your mind? I'm so distracted, my gosh. What's on your mind? What is on Capricorn's mind? Ten of Wands, Sagittarius energy. It's been a burden, right? But that's why you're moving away from from this. And it, I feel like with this, it's been a burden. And what you're finding out, it's like for naught. It's carrying other people's weight, trying to make things happen, trying to make other people's lives easier. It's just whatever situation it is, it's been a burden on your life. And you tried to make it work. I feel like you gave it all. You really gave it all. Okay. What is in the near future? What's in the near future for Capricorns? Oh, I love that judgment. I love when judgment and the world come out. A lot of times they seem to come out right next to each other. The world is saying, okay, I have to close this out. I, I am no longer able to fit into this tiny existence. I've, I've grown from this situation. I've learned my lessons. And this is about expansion, right? On your mind is, you know, this is just, yeah, it's beautiful flowers and all, but it's, 10 pounds of flowers or 10 pounds of bricks it doesn't matter it's still 10 pounds on your back times 10 you know this feels like a lot of weight over time and it's literally hunching you over and breaking your back and it, it could be just emotionally you know dealing with it because six of swords the reason for the reading is you getting away from it 
you're riding that storm cloud out of there. You want to be in the sun. And the judgment is the sun. I mean, it's behind her. She's illuminated. She, she realizes. Uh, it's like you see something for really what it is. And because you see the situation for what it is, maybe you got taken advantage of, maybe you got cheated on, maybe you got lied to, whatever was unfair to you with this justice reverse, you are truly letting it go. You can't go back because you see it so clearly now. Okay, how do the Capricorns see themselves? Okay, nine of wands reverse. I, I could not for the life of me put that card back. Sagittarius again. Nine of wands reverse. You given up, throwing your hands up. What's the energy coming in to influence us? What's the energy coming in to influence us for Capricorn? What's the energy coming in to influence us? The Queen of Swords reverse. See, it's interesting. Libra energy. Look, she's looking, right? I feel like you did go looking and you found something out. You, you found why you've been carrying this burden, why you've been working on something, and but it's not coming together or you're just, God, I feel like somebody could have been lying to you. Whatever this was, it's heavy. It's, it's, look at the, I mean, the major arcana that's surrounding this is, is ridiculous. But I mean, well, these three. But yeah, the Queen of Swords reverse, whatever she found out, it's, to me, this is a fed up card. This is fed up with the selfish energies. This is, you're fed up with carrying the weight for people. You're just, it's just, you're fed up. What's in your emotions? What's in your emotions? What is in your emotions? And the Page of Pentacles reverse. No longer given to it. I feel like, yeah, with this, ten, it's amazing. With this Ten of Wands, Capricorn, you've been worried about other people so much and nurturing them and helping them that you what you forgot is to nurture yourself. When she's upright, she's nurturing herself, her dreams. She, she tends to it every day. And look, it becomes the biggest flower of them all. And that's what you want. But it's reverse. It's reverse because you weren't given to yourself. You were given to everybody else. That's why this is a burden. We're out of balance here. And they were taking, they were taking just fine, weren't they? And this all could be work-related. I mean, especially with the Eight of Pentacles being here. This feels very work-related. What's the outcome? What is the outcome? What is the outcome? And Three of Swords. I, yeah, well, that's self-explanatory. No longer given to it. It's a burden. I feel like you get stabbed in the back. I do. No wonder both the decks were eight of wands. You getting out of there fast. Even by umbrella, you're getting out of there. Okay, what's this justice? What's this justice reverse in the world for Capricorn? What is this? Justice reverse in the world. Look at that ace of cups. Keeps wanting to come out. Ultimate healing. You healing yourself. It could be new love. It could be new love. I, Gemini's reading was similar. It was similar. And I'm getting a bit of the same feeling. Now, some of you, this, this is all work and maybe you're in a great relationship, but I feel like maybe you do need to get away. Maybe you need a vacation. You need to get your balance back to get this into perspective. I'm feeling the, you know, with the judgment being here, what, what needs to be done is leave this behind, which I feel like you will. But maybe there's new love on the horizon. I'm just saying. Okay, what's this justice reverse in the world for Capricorn? Justice reverse in the world. Okay, justice reverse in the world for Capricorn. What is this? Justice reverse in the world. Yeah, star reverse. It, there is no wish fulfillment. More importantly, they took, they, this is instead of the wish maker, they were the wish taker. <laughs> That's what you were dealing with. That's what I feel. It's like you were dealing with, maybe you felt like that. It's like, I, yeah, you were, or you were giving to other people, but this is unbalanced. This is unbalanced. See, she's on land, but she's also putting the water back. And it's like this flow. It's, it's being, you know, she's at peace on land and in her emotions, you know, physical world and her emotional world. But it's reversed because one you were given way too much to one side. And I feel like that's your pentacle world, right? Your physical world, your work world, whatever this was to you, that your emotional side is just like, oh my gosh, I can't do this anymore. I can't. 
and there's no happiness i feel like here it's just a lot of work a lot of burdens what's the six of swords the reason for the reading what's the six of swords i love that moving to calmer waters what's the six of swords and the high priestess and maybe you're staying silent about it at this time cancer energy maybe you're keeping this to yourself maybe whatever you saw that made you have to drop i feel like this ten of wands is really should be a ten of wands reverse you're dropping the weight but maybe you're keeping it to yourself until you know exactly what you're going to do because capricorn you are so practical you are you're not all, you're not a bit of a the full energy you're like okay i need something lined up maybe that's what this is about but you will with the six of swords i mean nine of wands is i mean look she's all scarred up how you see yourself you got scarred all one too many times three of swords is here okay what's this eight of pentacles in the past what's this eight of pentacles in the past for capricorn what's this eight of pentacles in the past and the two of swords let's see what is this eight of pentacles and two of swords and the Ten of Cups. Wow. Wow. I just said, uh, I mean, something, okay. If this is a job, I feel like, because you know what I feel like? You don't even feel anything in this. You don't feel anything. You blocked your heart. You have your eyes closed. You, you're on autopilot. If this is a job, you show up, you do your job, you collect your paycheck. Why do you do this? It's because for your family. It's for your loved ones. It's for even your own happiness, even if you're a single Capricorn. But I feel numb to on this, honestly. This Two of Swords, Libra Energy, and the Eight of Pentacles. It's just such a different energy because whatever you do should be vibrant. It should be your soul's purpose. It's transformational. You know, it, it's a job you have. It's not even a job. It's a career or it's a mission you have to do. because You don't have a choice because your soul is making you do this. And that brings in money, right? But whatever job you're in, I feel like you had to numb yourself. You you had to be blind to yourself. You had to block your heart. And no wonder you had to block your heart because look at the outcome. The three of swords right in the heart. In the past, you tried your best to not see things, to not engage, to not know. But it got too much. Whatever you found out, you realized with this ten of wands, you can't do it anymore. Okay, what is this ten of wands on Capricorn's mind? What is this Ten of Wands in Capricorn's mind? And the Eight of Wands reverse. You're blocking this. This might be, a, honestly, Capricorn, if this is a job, I don't think you're giving them any kind of notice. It's quick. What's this judgment in the near future? What's the judgment in the near future? Page of Swords. Yeah, you, whatever you saw. That's the only thing I can feel on this card is you saw something that made you say, oh, no, no, no. I see them clearly now. I can't go back. I can't go back into this existence of not seeing anything and not knowing anything and not hearing anything. And oh, Capricorn doesn't know, you know, we can fool Capricorn. You saw something Capricorn that made you blow the horn to come to life again, that made you have to change, that made you have to, to not give to this with the page of pentacles reversing your emotions to be fed up the queen of swords reverse and i feel like both i feel two energies on this influencing i feel like this is you being fed up what you're fed up with is selfish ass energies okay and disloyal energies what's this nine of wands reverse how you see yourself what's this nine of wands reverse how capricorn sees themselves and the world reverse this has been this is i feel like this is years this has been going on years. World reverse is repeating and repeating and it feels like it's never going to end. But nine of wands reverses. I can't. You're giving this up. You're giving this cycle of hell up. What is this queen of swords reverse? The influencing energy. What's this queen of swords reverse? Influencing energy. And the sun reverse. No happiness to be found. No hope to be found. And I feel like whoever this is, yeah, Ten of Swords Reverse, Gemini Energy. This person, if this is a boss, whoever this Queen of Swords Reverse is, they operate out of such a dark place. I That's just what I feel. I think their soul is very dark or they're very damaged. They're damaged people. I don't want to say people are irredeemable and they can't learn and they can't change. Everybody's capable of changing. But this person's very broken. If this was a boss or, or a person you're in a relationship with, this is what they hold on to. Everybody does them wrong, so they do people wrong. That's just all they know. I feel like that's all they know what to do. 
What's this Page of Pentacles reverse in your emotions? What's the Page of Pentacles reverse in Capricorn's emotions? And the Three of Cups reverse, backstabbing energies. Cancer energy. You are no longer going to give to it. These people that you've been carrying all this weight for, and you're just like, look at her, this poor girl. She's carrying the weight, trying to still pick another flower for somebody. When the, the, it's, there's almost nothing left of her, right? And here, you have a flower that nobody cared about. You need to be nurtured that nobody cared about. You needed attention that nobody cared about. And now you're caring about yourself. And why? Because they're all about themselves, about a good time. It's reversed because these people are backstabbers. They, this is when it's reversed, it's when people talk behind your back. It's like, it's very disloyal, right? And you realize they, you just realize what it's all been about. And maybe you feel fooled. Maybe you feel like you wasted a lot of time here. What is this three of swords and the outcome for Capricorn? Libra energy. Maybe some of you are dealing with a Libra. That's crazy. We got Libra, Libra, Libra. Where's the, I know the Libra right here. Okay. What's this three of swords? What's this three of swords for Capricorn? Nine of swords, Gemini energy. Here's the problem beyond this being a problem. If this is work, this is not something, maybe there was a time where you could block this out to do your job, you know, block your heart, block your eyes, and then you get home, you let it go. You know, you let it go on the outside of the door. It's like this relief, I'm home. Well, it's not that anymore. That's the problem. In the outcome card, you're literally taking it home with you. You can't sleep. You're waking up at 3 a.m. thinking about this. Only to wake up at 5 a.m. to get yourself ready to have to go to this place of hell, right? Nine of swords, three of swords. Yeah, it just, it, it feels like it's infiltrated every aspect of your life. And that is is where the justice reversed and the judgment is and the world. That is why you need to let this go. That is why you're moving on. That is why we have two eight of wands. And like I said, Capricorn, I don't, if this is a job, I don't even think you're giving them a notice. I think you are cutting this shit out, Libra energy. You are, you see it clearly. You aren't confused. You're making a tough decision and you're sticking by it. One more card on the three of swords for Capricorn. Look at all these swords though. Wow. What another card and the four of pentacles and it's your card upright, holding on to your value, holding on to your character, holding on to your integrity, holding on to your happiness, right? Because these people will try to take that too. At least you save something for yourself. And look at that bottom of the deck, 10 of wands and temperance upright, dropping it and getting your balance back. All right, Caps, that's what I have for you this week. I hope you guys have a lovely, lovely rest of your weekend and I'll see you next week. Take care.